<laughs> so we're going to start immediately um, get your tools your comb your set of comb um, yeah this one is like the cutting comb from the set then this is the brush for the gel I'm using Echo Styler gel and then you have the bobby pins right there yeah and then we have the afro comb then the another comb as you like it any one you prefer so let's go right into it so you have your hair well moisturized then you comb gently comb gently i don't um my hair can be soft and it can be hard at times but just try to comb gently comb as gently as possible comb it out just let everything come out so that your hair is like full now at the front you try to bring it forward just to make something um make cover your forehead or if you don't have um like wide forehead like mine you can probably just make it come towards your eyebrows yeah then you just adjust it like that see me looking pretty <laughs> okay so you see the sides we're going to adjust the sides right away you need your echo styler gel and the hairbrush so once you have that you can either use this hairbrush that comes with the set or a toothbrush then you take it and begin to apply gently gently don't brush your hair too much so that you do not pull out your baby hair or your front hair so you keep on brushing and brushing and then you take your comb just to like straighten it out straight to flatten it yes just like that you can take as much hair as you want just as you like it now you take your bobby pin and then you like clip it kind of like secure the head downwards yes yeah, so that it stays yep then you take another bobby pin because that one might one might not be sufficient and if you want to use up to three depending on how wide um the hair that you're taking backwards is so you clip it down just like that yes i hope you can see it clearly then you adjust the hair to cover the bobby pin yeah like i said you can take the um, gelled parts backwards more it doesn't have to be this short now you have to repeat the same process to the other side yes just keep on applying as far back as you want it to go and then you put your bobby pins to secure the um hair sorry you put your bobby pins to secure the hair and there you have it okay so now you have to begin to adjust the hair little by little because it's going to have to look full at this point the um front part of the hair you want to kind of like make it go inwards a bit with the bobby pin just like i just did and then you repeat the same thing for the other side as you can see it's clearer on this other side so you adjust let it look really puffy really really puffy yep that's it so you begin to um adjust the all um the hair every other side of the hair make it look full you bring it out so what i do is i pull my hair out gently or you can use a comb to like bring it out gently so that it looks full and it doesn't look rough so that you try to also smoothen it out yes so you make it as round as possible yes just keep on um bringing it out then like smoothening it so that it doesn't have rough edges as you can see check out all the corners you know you turn around just to make sure that it's a perfect look yep there you have it looking nice very simple and short it's like two seconds you have your hair done <laughs> And then you accessorize and 
you know make yourself look as pretty as possible and so I have this my rose or my flower basically you can put it at any side of the hair depending on how you want it and you can decide not to use it if you don't have one or anything to like decorate your hair for that but if you're doing like a photo shoot this is always very pretty the end <laughs> thank you for watching bye